hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are going to learn about how to set a 404 page error okay so guys we'll be learning about how to set a 404 error page in our um, admin panel okay or a normal blog so we will continue with our admin blog i mean admin panel dashboard and the blog of the php which we are continuing with it so guys as simple we'll go back to the code and we will see for the file 404 okay so you have to show 404 error right so for that now i'm going to create a new file over here so let's type here and create 404.php okay so our file is created now right so guys and now you have to design the file according to your wish according to your designs okay so i have already included the header tags and footer tags so this is my header mm -hmm. and this is the footer right so i don't need so i just going to include that those things so i just copy from the previous page itself okay so this is my 404 page and i don't need this this is my header and i'm going to copy one footer also okay so let's copy and tell this is footer.php footer.php done and now our page is set so yeah guys now we have to design one container for our for not fit page okay so let me view this first so let's go to google chrome and type format4.php file okay so this is a plain file which is open now so let's type hello control redo it is coming right so we want this to be designed very well and clear so you can just go and download any template or whatever you like so according to that you can set over there right so now let's I'm going to use the bootstrap thing so I'll just design it simple way so container row inside row I'm going to create one column that is MD and I'm going to create number six so I'll create six and then I'll create a card inside this so card and give a card body card body and then um, I'll give h1 heading tag okay so I'll give a class for this card title named error page okay error page and let's set this tell one more h2 that will be the card title also card title the only title that is 404 error okay and uh, we will give one paragraph and we will give a class for this called card text okay card text this is or you can tell the page you are you are searching for is not available okay done and let's see the output for this control r so error page it is designed okay it is coming perfectly but we want in center okay so let's just give a simple in the column itself we will give margin right that is auto and margin left auto okay i hope so it works okay yeah perfect so it is in center and we want this text to be in center okay so let's give um text center we are using bootstrap classes okay so it's perfect now so guys uh, I want little down to be this little down okay so let's give a padding over here 
So I'm using Bootstrap 4 and above version. So PY is available, padding and margin top. So if I give padding, it's coming down. Okay, so you can use margin top also. So it comes down, more down. Okay, so it's best. So guys, now we will set and we will give one simple color for this. BG warning I'll give and it is coming in this way. Okay, done. So this will be a 404 error page. The page you are searching for is not available. Okay, and let's go back to home. Okay, so we'll give one button simple button so let me give one button i will call a tag okay and call index.php file okay and tell go back to home page okay so yep it's coming but i want in a button so let's use a class class and we'll call the bootstrap class name button button I'll give primary okay done so if I give it will go to index page okay so it's set now and yeah so let us make the coding for how to if I type see here this is my home page about us dot php page and other pages too okay so if i suppose if i type unwanted page and what is coming it is giving non-object font but it should tell us that for this page is not available that is 404 php okay so this should be the answer for this so as to set this we have to go to our code and create one dot ht access file so dot ht access e a c c e s s access done okay so this is our dot ht access file we call it and a simple coding which you can give so uh, i use hashtag this is hashtag for commenting in a ht access file okay so we will name is that this is for not for error page to show okay so let's code it error document okay error document 404 and the link right so let's copy the link whatever you are using so let's type that 404 dot php file and just copy this control c okay control c and go and paste it over here control v done let's save this and yep let's go to our index page and reload the page so refresh it once again and now let's type some other page we don't need and we let's set okay boom so we got the error huh? for not for the page you are searching for is not available so guys now you have learned as very simple way in a simple way that how to set up for not for page okay if i'm just typing this 404 error okay whatever you are just clicking on wrong data and give enter it will tell 404 error page okay so guys you have learned in this video that how to set up 404 error page okay so just a simple code it is okay just create a hexi access file and a 404.php file okay done that's it in your root directory not in your admin dashboard it should be in your root directory itself okay so guys um thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share